Hey, what's up? Jigsaw here. Do you want to make a line chart for your Excel report? Well, as long as you have already figured out which data set you want on the x-axis and y-axis of your graph, creating one is quite easy. In this video, I will discuss the step-by-step -step process of making a line graph in your Excel spreadsheet. Let's go. To create a line chart in Excel, start by organizing your data into a clear table format. Once your data is ready, insert a blank chart area into your spreadsheet. Go to the Insert tab. Select the Line Chart icon and choose a style you prefer. Personally, I like to use Line with Markers for better data visualization. Next, right-click on the chart area and choose Select Data to configure the X and Y axes. For your reference, the left panel Legend Entries defines the y-axis or the vertical values, while the right panel, Horizontal Axis Labels, determines the x-axis or the horizontal values for your chart. The next step depends on the specific visualization you need, so you can just follow along as I demonstrate. In my case, I want to create a line graph to track my expenses for every month. To set the y-axis, click Add and name the series. In the Series Values field, select the range of cells containing your data. For the x-axis, click Edit. And select the range of cells that represent your horizontal axis labels, which for me are the cells that contain the monthly data. Once you've defined both axes, click OK to generate the line chart. If you want to add a second data set to your line chart, right-click on the chart area and choose Select Data again. In the Legend Entries panel, click Add and name the new series. Delete the default series values and select the range of cells containing your second data set. This will allow you to visualize and compare both data sets on the same chart. The secondary data set you added doesn't initially have value axis labels. If you want to add one, right-click on the line representing the desired data series. Select Format Data Series and choose Secondary Axis. This will allow you to compare data sets with different scales. To enhance readability, you can also add axis titles and a legend. Click the plus button on the chart, check axis titles and add descriptive labels for all axes. Also, check Legend and choose its position on the chart so that it's easier to identify each data series. You can further personalize your chart by exploring different chart styles and filters to better visualize your data. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or want me to create a tutorial about another topic, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.